Yo, what is up? Joshua Casper here with another Ableton Live Operator tutorial. Um, I'm really be getting into Operator a lot because it's just a, such a great synth and you can make so many just dope sounds with it. And it's native to Ableton and it seems to not take up as much CPU as like other um, synths, VSTs. And my computer is crap, so I like to uh, conserve, you know, my CPU when I can. But, um... Today I'm going to be showing you how to make this cool kind of Rhodes uh, trip hop chordy sound. It's very simple to make and it shouldn't take us that long. But uh, as usual, I'm going to go ahead and upload it so you guys can check it out. But, uh, you know, it shouldn't be that difficult for us today. So I'm going to come in and just delete this. And I got the MIDI, which is some chords on here from some random loop pack. Come into the instruments, drop the operator on here. And I'm only going to be using these first two oscillators here. This first oscillator, if we play it as is right now, we get a very nice sound. As you can hear, it's fairly loud, so I'm just going to turn it down. so loud because I have, you know, five different notes playing at the same time, sometimes six, so. Uh, it's already a dope sound, but let's make it a little better and more trip hoppy. So I'm going to take this attack and just kind of scoot it over a little bit. And the next thing I'm going to do is add some white noise on top of here. And if I use the noise white, um, I can't adjust the fine in the course parameters here and I want to be able to do that so I'm going to come in and just hit noise looped which is essentially the same but now I can adjust these parameters here so I'm going to turn it up just a tad and you see how that's at that course when it's down like that I want to be able to turn it up a little bit so let's try this that's giving me a much better sound so I'm going to come into the envelope now and what I want to happen, oh, it's storming outside so bad, please don't cut the tutorial. Um, I'm just going to bring it down like this. So I want it to hit real quick and take the place of, you know, this attack. And then I want it just to sustain for a bit, you know, for the rest of the note. Cool. And that, the magic doesn't stop there. There is a couple more adjustments we need to make. Um, I'm going to come into the pitch, I'm gonna turn it on, I'm going to crank it up to 100, the spread up to 100 as well, and that spread really works. Uh, it really adds a lot of um, character to the sound. So I'm going to play it at 100 and then turn it down and just to show you what's going on. <laughs> And right now that uh, I haven't adjusted my envelope, so it kind of sounds funny. So let me just go ahead and turn the envelope off real, real quick. Oh, by the way, if you click the number and hit delete, it will turn it back to zero for you. But anyway, uh, so spread on zero up to 100. Here we go. My opinion, much better. So anyway, let's turn that pitch back up and then adjust... Um, one, we want to adjust the attack over here, I don't know, like 67 milliseconds, so fairly quick, but I don't want it just to be right on the money, you know what I mean? And also the peak, I want to bring it down, so I want it to come from a lower pitch to the pitch of these notes, and um, just a little bit, just to add a little bit of character. So let's try this. <laughs> There you go. That's 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 like I don't know. It's just that sound, man. You hear that all the time. That type of sound in like uh, trip hop music, which I'm a fan of. So I don't know. You can use it for whatever you want to use it, or you can just you know do. I don't. I don't really care what you do. But that's a dope sound. I'm sticking by it. I hope you learned something, and uh, we'll see you next time. <laughs>